Welcome to Mega Design Arts. Today we will see this wonderful floor plan again. Very unique and very wonderful. So I will teach you this floor plan how we can design from the very beginning. This is very easy. Just keep in mind this is very very easy. So you can see here we have given everything our corridor more than 350 centimeter and we will see our apartment. This is our fire. We are getting 446 very wide space and this side we are getting 195 by 332 for bathroom and this side we are getting 711 for dining through living area, wide living area. We have followed minimum condition, maximum condition, everything as per rule regulation, how much I have placed everywhere as per minimum condition whether we have wide space in each and everywhere. So this is our internal living, 590 by 728 cm. You can place your sofa, your table, your carpet area, and you can give here a small cupboard. So you can see this is our duct, 542 by 513 for bathroom and window for kitchen, exhaust purpose. Even for services also will be covered from this duct. It will be open OTS so this kitchen is 540 by 740 we, we have given storeroom through kitchen 200 by 388 so this is our master bedroom we are getting 2 meter corridor 640 by 578 both master bedrooms same in size this is our dress area and this is bathroom this side I have given wide open uh, for exhaust window we can access balcony through this sliding window we have given for both master bedroom and living also. We can access our balcony through all the areas from bedroom and living. Here I have given bathroom in this corner so we don't have here exhaust. So we will use mechanical ventilation. So this is balcony, wonderful balcony. So like this. Number of 5 apartment covering this floor plan. So this is our service area, stair lobby and stair lift. Everything is stair and lift. So you can see this corner size, triangle area, we are getting service. We can place as per our requirement, we can place one room also. So depending on our requirement. So how, now I am going to teach you how to design like this in very much quick and very much genius way so just i have made this one plan only as usual i have made one plan only and i have trim add, un, add unwanted things i will select this same again i will use polar array command and axis of rotation this is our center point click this number of item 5 wonderful so you can see here our floor plan is completely ready so simply I have designed one only and I have made this polar, polar area it's coming something like this same same in between we have given our services and this corridor very wide corridor 3 350 approximate so this is our typical floor we can consider number of 5 floor, we can consider number of 2 parking floor, we can consider 1 ground floor for the proceeding the project. So you can consider G plus 2 parking plus 5 typical floor in this way. Even we have to focus our traffic study, our lift specific list requirement as per occupancy is enough or not, staircase, one is enough or not and services how we are arranged. A very very important thing, structural layout, final column layout, bearing support, what the issues will come. So this is a structural challenges. To be an architect, you must have to focus your unique design and structural calculation based on structural engineer, how they are finding their solution. So anyway, so this we are getting number of five flats, living, dining, each flats having living, dining, wide balcony, internal living plus kitchen with a store. 
so when we are when uh, when uh, whenever you have to make a, like this plan for a project you must mention this kind of thing in your sheet title it becomes easy to understand what functional functionality having for the floor plan so this floor plan easily we can understand through this text what we are providing here so this two bedroom with attached bathroom and one common bathroom so number bath number of bathroom we have three in this floor in this apartment everywhere and one store kitchen wonderful lobby and internal living and balcony living dining everything is completely functional and detailed so you can see here so like this plan is very much enough to uh, uh, very much uh, interested design you should practice like this drawing also it will make your work more flexible so you may not get like this design anywhere else possibly possibly so the, it does not exist anywhere it's completely imaginary i am just designed for the purpose to teach you you can learn this kind of thing in very much simple way and do something unique like this so we are learning high rise skyscraper also which is very wonderful learn something big why you should go through a deep mining level if you are learning so learn something very big so you can see here this number of five apartment is completely ready we have arranged in very much functional and very much technical way so what are the things balance you can figure out where is our column layout our column layout completely missing so we can arrange our column layout first of all and second we can arrange number of car parking how much and where we are coming and third our ground floor so like this it's very easy to coordinate with service map services and structural column layout and bearing supports even center we have given shear wall through stair and lift the rest of the part like column layout where we are coming we can provide in very much simple way that is not big issue so the main thing to be an architect you have to focus your unique architecture plan and design wonderful elevation we can go through elevation and section detail so if you got this video attractive and inspiring you can keep in comment section and what the thing you may suggest and we can go for the level like uh, detail section and elevation then we can go through rendering through 3d max or sketch up so if you like this video please let me comment what you should expect what you want to learn something else in this regard if you got this video helpful please like share and subscribe i will do really appreciate your support thank you very much we will see you next time